Salutations. Say hi, Eddie. You can say hi. Look at the, the camera there. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> oh, golly. It's been a poopy day. A day full of poo. I had a secondary face-to-face -face interview at the cooking store and the girl it was raining great guns this morning it was raining cats and dogs and um, there was someone was throwing out something down the street that I really wanted for my flower garden it was like a little section of fence I wanted to use in front of um, the gladioli that I have that grow and bend over and it would have been perfect except it was raining and I was on a time limit to get to the interview by the time I got back, it's gone naturally. But it's, uh, I got down there on time, <clears throat> met with a girl, probably my son's age, and, uh, there was really nothing to say. There was n no question that hadn't been asked. I guess she just wanted to get the feel if I was felt right to work there or whatever. I don't know. It's m 10 hours a week. At minimum wage, it'd be like less than seventy dollars after the government got their hands on part of the money. I can't live off that, and it's a far away. There's no. It takes six hours to get there by bus. Yes, St. Louis has mass transit, but it sucks. So, on the way back, I don't know what's going to happen. In a way, I kind of hope I don't get hired there because I don't know. It's just far and everything feeling discouraged. Um, I applied at a car dealership that's not too far from here and they said well you have to go to the main office. And since I was way out there I went by the main office and filled out a, uh, an application and learned that they have a brand new opening full-time as a porter. It's the guy that moves cars around makes sure they're washed and they're vacuumed out and that the battery is charged up. It's kind of a grunt job a custodian and crap job real crap job and I don't know what it pays but it just opened up today the girl told me so I applied for that since it's close by in decent weather and uh, I can ride my bike um, if I have to or want to and a bus goes near there so I don't know then I stopped at another car dealer on the way home and apply for anything I could get. I don't know what to do, and I I I had some time of crying on the way home. It just I guess the pendulum swinging the other way, and so I'll spend the afternoon crying probably, or drinking and sleeping, killing myself. I don't know. It just. I'm tired of it. I'm really tired of it. I mean, I know there are people out there that have degrees on the wall and everything else and probably can speak half of I mean, I can speak more than two languages. I have two associate's degrees, almost a bachelor degree. I have a third class radio license. I've done all I can multitask. It doesn't mean poop. I guess poop is the word for this whole vlog today. Poop. Poop, poop, poop! Upward and onward. <laughs>